some of them, some of them are like me, you know. One gets, one gets. <laughs> Just a little while ago, I was asked how old I am. I told them, I'm 18. <laughs> they didn't believe me. I'm just a little young boy just beginning to walk. You know, his father had to help me from the altar now. It's all good. So at this point of time, what can we offer to God? What would God expect from us tonight? My friends, let us acknowledge our sins and so prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries. I confess to the Lord and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done, in what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous
Why is life given to the toilers and life to the bitter in spirit? They wait for death and it comes not. They search for it rather than for hidden treasures. Rejoice in it exultingly and are glad when they reach the grave. Those whose path is hidden from them and whom God has hemmed in. The word of the Lord.
When the days for Jesus to be taken up were fulfilled, he resolutely determined to journey to Jerusalem, and he sent messengers ahead of him. On the way, they entered a Samaritan village to prepare for his, rece for his reception there. But they would not welcome him because the destination of his journey was Jerusalem. When the disciples, James and John, saw this, they asked, Lord, do you want us to call down fire from heaven to consume them? Jesus, Jesus turned and rebuked him. Jesus turned and rebuked them, and they journeyed to another village. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to the Lord. conceived it's painful for the mother when we are born it's painful for the mother and the child when we come out of the womb with the mother it's pain when the child is born 
the umbilical cord needs to be cut. And from birth to death, we are in this valley of tears. In Latin we say, Memento Homo, Pulveris Est, and Pulveris Revertes, his fame, his possessions, his family. Let us in faith call upon God, your mighty Father, who raised Christ, his Son, from the dead, as we pray for the salvation of the living and the dead. That the Lord be pleased to admit forever to the company of the saints his deceased servant, Father Fred, who once through baptism received the seed of eternal life, let us pray to the Lord. Lord that on the last day he be raised up, Father Fred, fed on the body of Christ, the bread of eternal life. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord hear our prayers. That he may grant to the souls of our, of our brothers and sisters, friends and benefactors, the reward of their labors. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. That God may graciously help and comfort our brothers and sisters who are suffering affliction. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. That he may, be, he may be pleased to gather into his glorious kingdom all who have gathered here in faith and devotion. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. May the power of those who cry to you benefit the Lord's souls of your servants, O Lord. Free them, we pray, from all their sins and make them share us in your redemption. To Christ our Lord. Amen.
offer our sacrifice this day, for Matinia may be acceptable to God the Father Almighty. In the Lord's sacrifice for the grace We pray, Almighty God, that through these holy mysteries, your servant and priest may be whole with charity forever, while he faithfully ministered here through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. in our salvation, always in every way to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, through Christ our Lord, for He is the salvation of the world, the life of the human race, the resurrection of the dead. Through Him the host of angels adores your majesty and rejoices in your presence forever. May your Voices, we pray, join with theirs in one chorus of exultant praise as we attain.
in a similar way when Sabo was ended. He took the chance in giving you thanks. He said the blessing. He gave the chalice to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many, for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. Mysterium Fidei Will you bless the apostles and glorious martyrs and all the saints? 